is a biography of Mitt Romney written by McKay Coppins that will be out in October. And the excerpts and the previews have shown a couple of interesting things. One of the things they've shown is that a number of Romney's Republican colleagues in the Senate are very critical of Donald Trump in private. And we've heard this so many times before, those headlines. Republican Congress members really don't like Trump. They all know how terrible he is. And the coverage, the tone of that is usually, you see, it's going to be okay. The Republicans get it. But I see this completely the other way. Donald Trump is a racist criminal who is an opponent of American democracy and supports a fascist movement. That is who he is, and that is who he has been since at least he got involved in politics back in 2015. So to some extent, while all of that is terrible, that's simply who he is. And we all should know that by now. For Republicans who know that and who choose to conceal that because they would choose not to tell the American people that, choose not to do something about that because they think it might be bad for their political careers, those people aren't going to save America. Those people are complicit, in some respects more complicit than Donald Trump in the destruction of America and in the destruction of American democracy. If all those people who in private raise their earnest concerns about Donald Trump's mental stability and commitment to democracy and intelligence and all of that kind of thing, if they had done that publicly and put some political effort behind those ideas, we might have been spared Trump in the first place.